getting our first look at a new Vietnam War Memorial in San Jose. It honors the thousands of South Vietnamese soldiers who died fighting alongside American troops nearly 50 years ago. As KPIX 5's Kit Doe reports, as the city with the largest Vietnamese population outside of Vietnam, it's a long time coming. The push, the motivation, the desire to build this monument is quite simple. If Vietnamese Americans don't tell their own story, who will? It is just five slabs of stone imbued with culture, history, and pride. In the spring of 1972, North Vietnamese forces had taken the ancient citadel of Quang Tri in the south in hopes of forcing the south to collapse. But the South Vietnamese army regrouped, and by summertime, the long slog to take back the city had begun. After three months of intense fighting alongside American GIs, a war photographer captured the moment the South Vietnamese flag was hoisted above the city again. Designer Lam Nguyen made that image the centerpiece, and the stone symbolized the tenets of Vietnamese culture. The base is the earth. The top portion will be the heaven, and the main panels will be the human being. Van Tan Tak and Phung Kim De survived that battle half a century ago. They say the memorial, remembering the 7,000 South Vietnamese soldiers who lost their lives, is bittersweet. When I look at this monument, it's been erected already, so they want to cry. The younger generation, when they look at this monument, they must remember and always commemorate those who died for freedom, democracy, and human rights for Vietnam. The team of organizers spoke about the struggles of teaching history before it's lost. Sad, sad because all the you know people sacrifice and we not even we lose our country. When you tell them, of course they know about it. When you show them the monument. That will be a spiritual thing. As Mary Lou Hammer, a civil rights leader, once said that there are two things that we should never forget. First is that never forget where we came from, and secondly is always remember the bridge that brought us over. In San Jose, Kitto, KPIX 5. The official unveiling takes place tomorrow at noon at History Park in San Jose. Police have arrested a driver who's accused now of hitting and killing an educator near San Francisco school. A memorial grows on the corner of Union and Frank.